Hello, my name is Jay Tholen. I'm a pixel artist, composer, uh, game developer, and person who does other dorky stuff like that. In Dropsy, you play as Dropsy, an unsettling looking but gentle clown who must rise above his harrowing past to save a world that hates him. Now, I know that sounds kind of depressing, but trust me, it's probably the happiest game you'll ever play. Now, five years before the game begins, a freak circus fire takes Dropsy's mother's life. The resulting rumors, combined with his already unpleasant appearance, drive Dropsy and his father into a life of seclusion. After stitching what's left of their ruined tent back together, they make a living collecting scrap metal and doing whatever work they can find. The game begins after a vivid dream that starts Dropsy on a path to discovering the truth about the fire and his own existence. Now, in Dropsy, I've created a rich world and mythos full of colorful characters and vibrant locations. Everything in this game is designed to reward exploration. Instead of being locked into one area, you're free to explore almost the entire game world at your leisure. Now, the plot progresses organically as you learn more about what exactly is happening around you. While there are still classic adventure game puzzles, they are greatly de-emphasized here. Like, instead of collecting and combining random inventory items, most of the things you find may be used in different ways throughout the entire game. Dropsy's face paint, for example, allows you to tag locations that you've previously visited. Now, there's also a complete lack of text in the game. Dropsy is not the best communicator, and because his ability to speak and understand was so central to his personality, I came up with a small but unique visual dialogue system. Game characters communicate using icons and expressive animations, and players may not always understand everything spoken to them, which is entirely okay. Dropsy doesn't either. Now this game has been in the works since 2011, and I'd love to be able to finish it as it was originally envisioned. To do this, I need your support. Other than pledging, the single most important thing you can do for the campaign is to share it. Spread the word on Twitter, Facebook, you know, whatever avenue you have. A blo blogs help a lot. And I, I appreciate all of you, and I can't wait to finally make this game. Thank you.